All right, so how about this? Great suggestion on the text during the break. Morgan's Dares for Dollars. Oh, that's a good name oh. for it. Dares for Dollars. It has like an old school like uh, bowling for dollars. Uh, right. I like it. I like Dares it for Dollars. Oh. Well done, 714. I, I kind of like it. I love it. I like it. You're, you're cool with that, Morgan? Yeah. All right. What does it have to do with bowling, though? I don't get that reference. There used to be a... a there used called, to be bowling for dollars. There was dollars. a TV show. Yeah, bowling so for dollars. So it just reminded oh. me. And you love bowling. I do so love bowling. Yeah. It makes it even more perfect of a marriage. It works. Dares yeah. for dollars. Morgan's dares for dollars. Now, last time, she got 25 bucks for getting tased. Mm. Or shocked. Shocked. Yeah, the those gloves. new taser gloves, right? And then uh, the time before that, the first uh, trip around was for the... Pocky one chip challenge thing, the newest one that just came out that killed that kid. Discontinued. <laughs> Discontinued after they, you know. Oh, yeah, we. Yeah. For other, it wasn't the chip, but it was just, you know. Just a bad, just yeah. a bad reaction. A combination of things. What did they say? There's a difference between causation and uh, correlation. Correlation. I mean, yeah, it was bound to happen at one point. Yeah. But was it the chip or was there something else going on? We don't, Obviously, I right? don't know. I've seen an autopsy. autopsy never yet. heard. But for that one, she got 600 bucks. Now, the way right. it works is we all try to figure out like what she should do. And then uh, we narrow it all down. You guys vote on the final. Once we get it narrowed down to the final three, you guys vote on which one you think it should be. And then uh, once she does the challenge, then she gets to spin the wheel. And there's all kinds of denominations on there, up to like a thousand bucks or something like that. Mm-hmm. And uh, that's how much she gets. The dares four dollars. I, I like it. It sounds good. It sounds better than you're a prostitute saying what will she yeah. do for money? Right. Right. Anything's Agreed. better than that. Yeah. <laughs> Agreed. It worked when Randy did it. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. he's kind of a whore. Kind of. Because he yeah. is a slut. Yeah. yeah. I mean, he faked uh, saying that he, he was, was on going, meth. It was his plan, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. He was going to fake saying that he was a regular meth user <laughs> to get into one of those studies that they pay you to be a part of. Yeah. Right. He's like, right. I took Adderall once. Yeah. He said because he'd had some Adderall. <laughs> he was legal basically meth. Yeah. yeah. It now, is meth's dirty cousin. If uh, you got an idea of what you should do for her next dare, you can give us a call, 877-44-WOODY. You can hit us up with a text over to 22987. Now, the other ones that were uh, up there, they, if we mentioned it the last time, like the, the finalists yep. uh, last time, was the, the baby birding from Menace's Mouth. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. Mm. So, yes. like, Menace oh, would, you'd be so lucky. Menace yeah. would chew some food. Oh, lucky. Yeah. And then baby bird it, mm. yes. a.k.a. spit it into <laughs> And yeah. like something mouth. like nasty, like marshmallows yeah. oh, that would be like so... All foamy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> And Menace mm. would get food. Yeah. And Menace could eat win, marshmallows. Win. You get the good end of that one. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-mm. Uh, mm-mm. There was also uh, drinking tobacco chew spit. Oh. <laughs> those, no. are, those are the final three. It was the taser, the tobacco <laughs> chew spit, and then the baby burning. <laughs> Which one did you veto? Tobacco? I think uh, so. I, was there one more that yeah, I that was that, that was no. the veto. That I, put the the, yeah, okay. I put the big V next to it. So that was the one. Yeah. That, was, that was the veto. The wow, I should where, remember that. Where would we even get that? Like, I don't know anybody that's... I, I see it once a year, maybe. Yeah. I'm sure we could find some. I mean, Somebody I can make choose. some if you want to yeah, pass out. Some. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I, 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 see Bass in here just What's tipping. the new thing? Zins? Zins. Yeah, they, yeah. The, little, the little... I saw a guy drop his Zin pack in the in the parking lot yesterday, actually. <laughs> so oh, I yeah. grabbed it. I think Burke Kreischer's big on those now. Yeah, that, which is basically just the little pouches that you put in your mouth and it slow-release nicotine. And but his I, wife, Leanne, is not psyched. Yeah, but I think he's on to a new thing that um, Tom Segura put him on. It's called Rogue. Rogue. Yeah, it doesn't have tobacco in it. Oh, okay. But it gives you the same buzz. All right. Okay. So I, they say. This is what they're talking about. Maybe you should try it. See that? So, so early it. 80s. Try it. I know. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. So you said you had an idea, right? So this is the only time of year where we get to have Santa Claus. <gasps> yeah. Uh. Uh-oh. <laughs> no, it's not a bad like thing. It. Yeah. Right? Not, What's wrong? I will not say go take a crap in Santa's lab. <laughs> I'm saying interview roulette with Santa Claus, but with oh. wishes. So again, this is a little higher concept. So we all write wishes that Morgan has to go sit on Santa's mm-hmm. lap and give to him deadpan and try to get him to agree to, like, you know, see, she, see, she gets, she gets it. Okay. So, like, sitting on okay. the ball, yeah. okay. Santa's lap? Yeah, so like, go in to a ball, Santa. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Give her a list. She, she is all written out, you know, like, scroll style. Uh-huh. Yeah. With embarrassing oh. wishes. Right, embarrassing. And, yep, and, yep. and she'll get, like, points or dollars in this case for every wish she can agree, get Santa to agree to. Like, oh, I wish not to have nuclear periods anymore. <laughs> right. But, yeah. but I don't know if he'll agree to anything. Is that how, yeah, is that how it works when you sit on his lap? He says, like, yes or no? Yeah. Well, that's because, like, what, what do little kids do? They say, oh, Santa, I would like. I want mm-hmm. a Barbie. I want yeah. a PS5. And he's like, I'll look into that for you. Right. <laughs> you know, they never promise because 
Yeah, uh, exactly. Parents, but what right. is true? What does right. it matter? We just want her to ask. <laughs> right. And right. Then, okay. I'm, saying, I'm saying from the money yeah. aspect, he doesn't necessarily agree. Right. We can right. work out those details. Mm-hmm. I yeah, like the detail. concept. Yeah. I, the I concept like I like a lot. Because it's, like yes, it's lot. this time right. of year. Are you writing that down? I'm, I'm keeping yeah. a list. Okay. Santa, yeah. Santa wish list. We of course we write them for. And you can't mm-hmm. just you can't just you couldn't just barrel through it like I want you know no nuclear periods yeah. and all, you know all the all the sex yeah, all the sex stuff. Also, it's <laughs> you wish, really got to interact pause, with it. Yeah. Pause. All right. Well, I've yeah. got and then I've got another one. Okay. And then eventually he'll kick you out. But that would be hilarious too. Yeah. And then you just go on to the next mall. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, sounds fun. <laughs> it does. And it's it does, right. it's yeah. more than just a jackass. It's you know it's high like I said high high concept yep. asking Santa about your period. <laughs> 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 uh, what if it was true though that would be a yeah. double win yeah, yeah, nuclear exactly. period. what if you got that wish <laughs> right all right uh a woody show tattoo do you have a tattoo at all do you have i do t- have okay tattoos. you do yeah um, i do well i love tattoos but every time i've gotten them and they're very small i pass out oh, Ooh, oh so really? that, that could be fun Ooh, that could be nice. for y'all <laughs> um, don't you have a tattoo of something you have no reference to yeah i have a rolling stones tongue Oh, that's right. But I never listened to them. I just think they were brilliant with branding. Oh, dude. We have a station in the company mm-hmm. in Chicago. Rock 95.5, I think it is. And uh, there was this mega fail on their part. So the Rolling mm. Stones are doing this tour. Yeah. And at Soldier Field is where the Stones are going to be playing. And they posted the Rolling Stones, mm-hmm. you know, tongue logo thing right. at Soldier uh-huh. Field. And they posted, said like... Uh, up oh, guys, look what was spotted at Soldier Field. Hit us in the comments and tell us what your favorite Kiss song is. Oh, uh, yeah. It was a rock station. <laughs> yeah, that's bad. Well, I thought that was fake. That what was 12-year-old do they have running social? Well, <laughs> the, the guy who's in charge of that station was one of the guys when we first started here was so vocal about how we were never going to do well, the show was never going to do anything. Who's that? Uh-huh. And this guy, James Howard. Mm. And uh, and so yeah, like so he runs that station. I sent it uh-huh. to him in an email. I'm like, That's hey man, because awesome. it made this industry thing that rips on stations mm-hmm. that screw up stuff. I say, hey man, you made it. Uh, yeah. Well, it's probably like here where they've got a 22 year old who runs right, exactly. social for all the stations, and they don't know what's With going no on. With no reference to anything. Uh, on the text, some suggestions. Dares for dollars for Morgan. She should sit in an ice tub, like one of those. Um, oh, I could bring in a portable ice bath. Oh, can you? Have portables? Yeah, yeah she, yeah. she bought one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, like some people have the ones that like you constantly have, you know, right. filled and it's set at a certain temperature to keep that temperature. Right. Well, this one's kind of like a kiddie pool. Yeah, this one, like, you got to actually bring bags of ice yeah. and stuff and put it so, together. So, AKA a kiddie pool. Right, but it's yeah. like really deep uh, and small. Like a little, trough. Like only one person yeah. could fit in Trash can. And you do yeah. that for fun? Yeah. Oh, it's very trendy. These Everyone's oh, doing so cold. In. super in. Oh. Yeah. Mega it's cold. Therapeutic. Like it takes out <laughs> therapeutic. It takes out your toxins and stuff. Yeah, yeah. realize yeah. chakras. Yeah. 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 I can use that. And balance. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Balance my chakras. I feel so balanced afterwards. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else do we have here? I mean, I have one. Yeah, what do you got? I was looking through the Woody Show archives just recently, and a great visual and great audio is the Cinnamon Challenge. Oh. Only but mm-hmm. goody. That was uh, that was on the list last time. The cinnamon challenge. That it's, was a consideration. And you just swallow what? Oh, well, you, you try. try. You try. <laughs> a yeah. teaspoon of cinnamon. Okay, yep. I missed that when it was big with the kids. You know? Oh, yeah. You would have been a kid back then. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. So it was a, it's a teaspoon of just cinnamon. And uh-huh. it's essentially impossible. And you try mm-hmm. to swallow it. Yep. But Menace tried to do that, man. He oh. looked like a fire-breathing dragon. <laughs> yeah. I don't think cinnamon. anybody's ever been able to swallow <laughs> I don't, yeah. yeah. I don't think anybody In the has. History. Yeah. That's In the, the history point of it. But it sounds great on air. And visually, it looks great. great. Okay, we also have. Um, I think we had a Lego walk on there. Yeah, the the Lego coal walk <laughs> was on oh. there. Somebody also texting over says uh, an in studio downstairs waxing. Yeah, <laughs> I would like that. Yes. Have you ever had one? I have not. I'm very curious. I don't know, man. I, I've I done see it. People... Doesn't go. It doesn't grow back the same. <laughs> oh, in a good way or a bad on, way? Oh, I've bad done it way. for a radio show. In a good way. What do you style it? I don't yeah, know. Maybe how it would it grow back, back cuter. I don't know. <laughs> Come back cuter. Right now it's very, it, grow, it grows back Different hair colors. Crazy. I don't know. Like a different consistency. Maybe a little curl. I don't know. Yeah. Well, that's how they get you. Just <laughs> wave to it. Because you have to keep on going back to maintain it. It's got a lot of body. Like a perm. I don't know. Yeah. Because right. then it's all like wiry and weird. Yeah, and weird. It's yeah. not all oh, soft and well. cute. Uh-uh. <laughs> The opposite they're of They're pubes. They're always kind of like thin. Right. They're never. Yeah, but it's like extra. So you you waxed your pubes? Yeah. Oh. I thought you did like your back or your chest or something like that. I could see people doing that. That area, just so like oh. sensitive. That's different skin down there. Can't imagine. Yeah, it's not fun. 
I mean, at least when I did it. Like, I, I mean, hey. And it was shout out to you ladies who do that. Yeah. I've waxed my nostrils. Thing. That rules. Oh, God. That, that sounds really rules. So That's clean. also mm, super so painful. clean. You breathe so nice. Anytime you pluck a nose hair out, oh, I that hate along, that. it brings a tear to your eye. The waxing's easy, though. Aren't you supposed to not do that? Yes, you're not supposed yeah, you to do that. You need your nose hair. Kill yourself? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh, well, that thing. The whole, Kill yourself. Like, yeah. isn't it connected to your brain? Yeah, that's the, the triangle. One thing. of the trillion people die that way. Hmm. Yeah, my dad's got yeah. that. He's got. I, I was. I might get him a, a nostril waxing kit. Ooh, oh, yeah. He's well because he's getting to that age where like, we talk about with <laughs> exactly. older men, where it's completely unruly. Yeah, it's, it's like, it's like dude, I could see it coming out of your nose. Uh, spider on the face. Oh my like, god! Let a, let a spider spi- on the face. Yeah, like let a spider. You've seen those videos where yes. people have a spider crawling on their face. Are you bug phobic? I'm not. I actually had a birthday party when I was a kid, and my mom had this zookeeper bring all these tarantulas and spiders and stuff to the fun, house and we dude. played with them Oof. yeah okay it was fun <laughs> your um, mom's weird <laughs> there's another one here morgan sucks on one of menace's toes oh, okay that's wow. the, probably the worst suggestion i've heard so yeah. far she'd veto the hell out of that <laughs> eat a raw onion like an apple wouldn't bother me i don't think well there's a way to get the menace toe thing in there is you just throw in something mm. even more heinous <laughs> therefore to menace toe Oh. Right, like it's oh, an yeah, attractive yeah. option, like, or or his toe dipped in Vegemite or something. Ooh. Oh yeah. God! Oh yeah, or toe taste test. Vegemite. <laughs> oh, like toe. toe jam. Like just yeah, put like uh, oh, any kind of like uh, sauces, preserves. Oh, right. Yeah. We could do a different. Yeah, we could have different <laughs> yeah. like <laughs> flavors. Get marmalade. Yeah. Right. Up on that. <laughs> a toe taste test. Uh-huh. Yeah. That, that, that was, uh, Apricot. Yeah, that, fig. Jam, that stuff that Greg brought in was really good. Well, yeah. she would have to get the preserves. Yeah. Like, would she get like? That amount of money for each time she tried a toe jam? No, it's no. It'd be like it'd be like so like five. No, not all five, but we can say like three. We can we can come if people like that idea. We'll come up with like the parameters of it, right. but yeah. it's the general idea. Yeah, Ravy. It's like Seabass's concept's really good. What if we she can figure out the twenty five bucks again, and then had to put Menace's toe in her mouth three well, times. All right, well that's how it works. That's how yeah. it works. Or it's it could be for a thousand bucks. Yeah, you never know. <laughs> Just looking at yeah, it, Morgan. Just spin the wheel yeah. in the right way. I know. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. I've been thousand. practicing. Just spin it better. I did see a video of this once. The mouse trap hug. What's that? Like you wear mouse traps on the back of your shirt, and then she has to hug the person wearing it. Oof. Jeez. That'd be brutal. I think it's oh. probably just easier to put, put them on the floor and roll on them. What are we attaching them to shirts yeah. for? Yeah. <laughs> it's too much work. Or. I, or there's a mouse trap in one of the boxes. You got to put your hand in. Oh, you got to pick God. a box. Ooh, mystery box. Oh, break oh, your finger. We did the uh, Papa John's garlic sauce. Oh, drinking God. that one time where we got all those great uh, barfing. I would like some more barfing on you. Yeah. Somebody said, uh, "What about like some of these holiday creamers that they have oh, out? Oh, oh yeah, like these holiday doable. coffee creamers might be doable. But, oh, but like imagine if it was like a hazelnut creamer. Oh. Yeah." Don't Pure those taste good? Perfume. No, hazelnut is disgusting. Well, the reason it's in there is because it sucks. <laughs> the, reason, <laughs> the reason you'll always find it yeah. is because nobody likes it's it. Yeah. Gross. There is not, Papa John's doesn't have the garlic sauce giveaway like they had, but you can buy the, the generic version for like 25 bucks. Oh, you can? You know, from like restaurant by the supply. gallon. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, like restaurant okay, supply. Yeah, place, restaurant yeah. supply. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> is Costco sell that? I think. <laughs> how much of that crap do you need? I think the long play stuff is fun. If you have to like wear something for five days, or yeah, you know, have something on you for five days. Right. Yeah. Where you'd be embarrassed about it, and you can't do anything oh, about strap it. Strap on. Uh, so <laughs> Yeah, wear a strap on at work all week. Temporary um, mustache. Right. It's just something oh. weird. Yeah. Poop your pants in a diaper. <laughs> I've got a uh, diaper. Who is that benefiting? Let's be real. Mm-mm. I saw Let's legit. See if you can do it. Like <laughs> yeah. model Let's dudes wearing happen. diapers. Oh yeah. At, when I was at Costco, they it, why it, they didn't show like old men. It was like young guys wearing well, I, diapers. I brought this up recently. That's like the new Depends model. Is just yeah. some like fat thirty-five year old. Uh, all so. right. <laughs> More like an experiment. Now, see if this is yeah. Greg, because you don't you don't mind going at work, right? No. Yeah. See if it was Greg, we could do something like where Greg would have to take a dump at work, nice. but we'd mm. set up like a PA system, so he brings a microphone <laughs> in with him, and we have the and we have the speakers <laughs> outside, and he has to go, "Hey, uh, yeah, uh, it's Greg Gore. Uh, Gore. Yeah. Who's I, ready I'm, for dumping? Uh, yeah. Pooping right now. <laughs> pooping. Guess where I am? Yeah. Guess where I'm in the bathroom. I would yeah. have to be put into a mental hospital after that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Quit. I'd be so I'm disturbed. I'm That'd be Greg. so funny. Let's have a conversation. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Greg. I'm <laughs> pooping right now. 
<laughs> yeah. Hell no. Because I think if yeah. I was wearing a diaper, I don't think I could. It's like go, a mental thing. Yeah, I don't right. think I could just relax. Well, we could. Pee well, in we it. could just right. get PJ X lax until. Well, uh, we'll we'll come back. <laughs> we'll come back later in the week, and then uh, we'll wow. try to figure out what else we're gonna do here. Send over your ideas. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll narrow them down later in the week. But yeah, between now and then, so either hit us up on the text two two nine eight seven. Um, you can also hit us up on the After Hours voicemail if you have something you think about later on the day, anytime after 10, 877-44. Woody, send us an email, email at thewoodyshow.com. But uh, yeah, Morgan's Dares for Dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Fancy new name, Dares yeah. for Dollars. LFG.